A week ago, we convened here in Fonseca for the Pia Co Design Summit 2017, organizing collaboration with World Vision and CINOVA. Ha sido muy interesante esta alianza que se ha generado desde MIT D Lab con World Vision para llevar a cabo eh, tanto el CCD como el CDS. Ha sido un trabajo fundamental de, de, de cohesión, de equipo, de relaciones interpersonales también. Y eso creo que ha sido un punto fundamental para que el desarrollo de este proceso sea positivo. 15 community members from the communities of Conejo and Colonias joined us to work on five projects around thematics that have been identified as critical needs for these communities. Tantas problemáticas que se han manifestado dentro de la comunidad eh, sobre el agua, sobre manejo de carga en las sierras de las colonias, sobre cómo eh, apreciar las frutas. Project teams incluyen people from the Practical Impact Alliance, people from the communities and also social entrepreneurs from the Colombian ecosystem formed to identify and develop solutions to these needs. So we had the chance to walk around, to meet with people, discuss with them, and we learned a lot about the things that they are already doing. And they seem to be really interested in sharing and also in trying to think in a better way <laughs> to do it among ourselves. They went through a process of uh, problem identification, idea generation, and ultimately came up with solutions that they refined and presented to community members at the end of the week. Ya habiendo acotado el problema, empezamos a encontrar soluciones. Empezamos a encontrar hipótesis. ¿Qué era la causa y qué era el efecto? Empezamos a experimentar con las soluciones posibles, eligiendo ideas locas, tranquilas, posibles y no posibles. Y a través de eso empezamos a realizar prototipos de la mejor solución que encontramos o de las mejores soluciones. We've gone through a lot of different process and a lot of thinking to make sure that the solutions that we're thinking about are going to be helpful but also cost effective, um, sustainable, long lasting, scalable. So there's a lot of considerations that we're taking into account to make sure that these are going to be real solutions that hopefully the community can carry forward after some of us uh, leave this summit. Today, at the close of the summit, the predominating sentiment was one of extreme satisfaction because we realize how much has been done in only one week. Participants expressed their appreciation for the co-creation process and debriefed about their key takeaways from the experience. We ourselves, the Siemens Stiftung, is working a lot in a what's so-called empowering people network with organizations that use technology. So to combine these opportunities of co-designing local people on the ground, as well as the, the necessity to have um, technology, was for, for us a wonderful opportunity to, to explore. Being able to be in Ponseca and go to Conejo and Las Colonias, um, to see the reality, to be able to concretely speak with the beneficiaries, to be involved from the design, through the multiple solutions and then combining all the ideas to create one and to use co-design methodology has really been a very, very valuable um, experience for me. Tanta diversidad de culturas, de idiomas, eh, de personalidades y trabajar todos en un, bajo un mismo fin es una experiencia única y sobre todo con el objetivo final de encontrar soluciones a diversos problemas que tiene la comunidad de Conejo. Y este proceso de involucramiento me parece que es una forma muy viable y muy sostenible de traer mejores oportunidades para Colombia. Vamos a poder combinar un montón de estrategias y un montón de objetivos para llevar mejores soluciones a las comunidades y esto va a repercutir en un mejor desarrollo y competitividad para Colombia. As organizers, we feel an extreme sense of satisfaction because we are not only uh, leaving behind a group of people who are empowered to move these solutions forward, but they also have the tools and the mindset to do so. Y me siento feliz por eso y sé que algún día vamos a salir entre todos adelante. Habemos muchas madres cabezas de hogar. También que no tenemos una casa porque los materiales son muy costosos. Y no tenemos tampoco un empleo. Entonces ya que aquí lo tenemos todo, que muchas partes no lo tienen, podemos hacerlo entre todos.